Hello everyone, I'm Mike, and here's my spoiler-free review of The Flash. To start, the movie shares the same plot as other Flash renditions such as Flashpoint. This is where Barry Allen tries to reverse his mother's death. I actually kind of liked how the movie resolved this issue. It was very satisfying and helped to evolve Barry Allen's DCEU character. In terms of acting, I think Ezra Miller was phenomenal. I feared that he was going to be outshined by Michael Keaton's Batman. Yeah. I'm Batman. But that simply wasn't the case, as Keaton did a great job at helping drive along Barry Allen's story and helped Miller get a little nuts in the process. I wanna get nuts. Let's get nuts. As seen in the trailers, Miller had to play multiple versions of himself, which he did very well, making each one feel like their own unique character. Minute, wait, Why is there I, like four of us right now? What is going on? Exactly. Exactly. Alrighty guys, we gotta get back to the review here. This is out of control. Is that he goes from being the janitor of the Justice League at the beginning of the film to actually becoming a real true hero like Superman or Batman. As for the negatives, I agreed with most of the online comments saying that the CGI was poorly done. The cameos were also CGI generated extremely poorly and I thought if they spent a little bit more time on that, they could have done a lot better of a job. Speaking of cameos, a large worry I saw most people have was that the cameos would be DC's way of making it up to fans for The Flash being a somewhat average film, but this wasn't the case at all. Without the cameos, I still think Flash would have been a great film. These only serve as small little easter eggs for longtime DC fans to enjoy. Overall, I think The Flash was a good movie and that any DC fan will appreciate it. I'm excited to see where the DCEU goes following this conclusion. As for my rating, I'm going to give it an 8.3 out of 10. Stay tuned for more reviews, and thank you for watching.